So it's been stormy here for like a week straight. But I was just thinking about it. Like, I think I'm gonna rearrange this room and put the sleeper sofa back together as a sofa and assemble my bed. That's gonna be a lot of work. Basically everything in this room has to move and when it moves, there's a lot of things. Like it's just gonna be a game of Tetris. <laughs> I think that sounds good. Um, I'm tired of sleeping on my sleeper sofa. It's it's like got a hole in the middle of it. So like I basically either sleep on the edges or across the top, <laughs> like this direction. I'm gonna have to open doors to rooms that are cold. So that means I better get my fire going again because it burned out on me, didn't it? Don't mind my wonderful outfit. in there well but they're in there um the lamps need to get put in there too do i have a box for them
did I damage this cushion thing that? <sighs> back in that corner so actually this tail needs to come back they're gonna have to stay stacked like they were before It's got some dings, but maybe I'll start it at like 80 and we'll see. Cool. Okay, so that's listed. So that was like the first step because this desk was in front of the bed. So I guess now I need to get the desk back out of the way so there's some place for the bed to go. 
think I'll have to lean the bed against this wall to be able to do the switcheroo and stuff. This would have been a very bad bag to lose. Uh, these are our little legs for the bed. I'm missing a screw. Luckily I have like 400 of them. are definitely tighter than the top of bottom.
Oh, that's rat poop. Is that poop in between the layers of plastic? Yes, it is. Okay. How do I keep it there? <laughs> so diluted vinegar it is the thing is is it's probably really old and sterile anyways because mouse poop is only harmful oh, it's only harmful for like six months i want to say I didn't break. is working okay I think I made a room made a spot for the pile here sure it does. I don't think they're going to be a permanent solution, but they think will be like underwear and stuff like that drawer inside the wardrobe. So that will be really cool. And if they do fit by the measurements, then I can just put that stuff in it now. Because right now it's all in like bins that are like scattered around and you're so damn cute. What I should try and do now is get the blanket off of that. Really wish I had done that in the first place now. Hindsight's 2020. <sighs> the cool thing is that now I know that I can fit at least two people in this house. Actually, really, they're two queen beds, so theoretically I could do four people, plus I have an air mattress that goes in the homestead. I can actually fit quite a few people in here. Get all the teddy sand out of here.
way easier that time. I think I had the mattress lined up badly the first time. Squeaky. Wow, I have a sofa again. I really hope this sheet fits better now that it's on an actual queen bed because before it would like bunch up and collect a bunch of sand in it. I mean, it fits tighter, but I wouldn't say it's tight. I think it'll still do the same problem. Teddy's like, wow, we got a sofa again. This is crazy. Teddy's gonna be really sad. Also, oh, there's a mouse. That's where it went. I knew it went somewhere, I couldn't find it when I was vacuuming. Teddy's gonna be sad that the couch, because there was the two layers, the couch and then this cushion. So he could lay up there really comfortably and look out the window. But things change, sorry, mister. Okay. this couch set up, I didn't have these white pillows out of my storage unit. I knew they'd go good. Beautiful. Oh, I need my white blankie. Very nice. The only problem now Maybe I will move one of those side tables over here. I kind of need two lamps now, because if I'm over there, sitting on the couch, or if I'm in bed, I need two lamps now, Teddy. I'm gonna move. This blanket is so bunched up. I really need to do laundry, but I can't do laundry when it's raining outside because I can't dry it. So I have got a lot of laundry to do. <laughs> that duvet is so messed up in there. <laughs> oh. I think I have a stool I can use as a side table. Because I was also thinking that that plant's really long. I don't want to cut it yet. There's a stool in here somewhere, right? Ikea is just so timeless. Everything I'm pulling out from my storage unit that I'm like, oh yeah, I still want to use. All Ikea. This is an Ikea stool. Okay, little nightstand. Just a little something something. Because like I have stuff pulled out from the wall 
Obviously I can't do that with the bed because then the pillows will fall back behind. But like the couch and stuff, they were really far pulled off the wall and now they're only a little bit. So I did actually gain a little bit of space. You are being ridiculous. <sighs> Baby, you have to cuddle.